Hey everybody, it's Andy aka Max Rider. We're back with another Let's Play of another 8-bit game. I'm trying to get my stupid timer. There we go. There it goes. So, Mermaid Swamp was recommended to me by... Can I make this bigger? I can't really make that any bigger. So... It was recommended to me by... My friend Amberlin actually recommended this one. This contain this game contains grotesque and somewhat sexual images. Please be mindful of this as you play. The author takes no responsibility in advance for any trouble or damages indirectly brought about by the game. Trouble or damages? What does that even mean? Rin Yamazaki. What the? Uh, am I underwater? Am I underwater? What the hell am I doing? Ooh. Somebody there? This is Rim's name. Er. Ugh. That's kind of creepy. Rin, wake up! Oh, we're in a car. That's kind of cool. Uh, Sotaro. Stop sleeping already for crying out loud. Who's talking? I can't really tell who's talking. Ah, shut up. Does that mean the blonde guy? I was just taking a nap. That so bad? One hell of a nap. You'd have been driving all this time, and you've been snoozing in the back. Sheesh. Not a hint of a lady in this one. Oh, my girl. Not exactly interested in being ladylike for an early balding punk like you. Ouch. Uh, Yuka. Rise and shine, Rin. I'm going to guess you slept well, given you started around noon. Yeah, but thanks to Baldy here, more of a rude awakening. What you yammering, Yamazaki? Ooh, burn. Sick burn. Uh, Sotaro. Hey, Yuta. Where are we anyway? I gotta give them all different voices. You said something about kicking things into high gear. But are we in the mountains? Or what? Haha, <laughs> my bad. I don't know where this is either. Huh? You telling me we're lost? Yep. Don't have the first clue where we are. You gotta be kidding. You said the mountains were a shortcut, so I thought you knew the way. Sorry about that. I mean, I did kind of know at first, but the fog got so thick. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, that ain't funny, shrimp face. That's me. Rin. This is exactly why I don't want to go on a trip in your lousy old GPS-less car. Ah, don't kick the seat. Oh, that was me. Okay. Well, now what do we do? I can't even see any signs. I don't know which one is me. I'm in the back seat. It's either the blonde girl or Yuda. Huh? Yuda, why did you stop? I didn't. It just stopped. Hold on, I'll try the engine. Dude, those are some pretty loud sound effects. Oh crap, I think it's totally busted. Are you for real, dude? You dumbass! Ugh, wait here, I'll go t out and take a look. Is that this? No. You know what? I need to open the README file and see what the controls are. Ender. So, hold on one second. I will continue to talk while I look for this. It should be right about Mermaid Swamp. Uh, read me. So, let's see. We're... Alright, I don't, I don't see any instructions. So, maybe I'm just not looking hard enough. Let's go. We're walking in the fog. Walking in the fog. I don't know how to do things. But, um, uh, sit down Walking in the fog. Nothing looks wrong to me. What the? Why the hell did you, it stop? Nothing looks wrong to me. Let's look in the front. Huh. In the bushes. Huh? <gasps> somebody there? Oh, who's that? There's a guy. I am the blonde. Quite a surprise. What would you be doing up in these mountains, miss? Just an old coot. Damn it, don't freak me out. We were on a trip, but our car went kaput, so I guess we're stuck. That's very unfortunate. Is there anywhere you can stay? Nah, but we can't get it running. I guess we'll be spending the night in the car. You needn't do that. My home is nearby. You can stay there, even if it's summer. It's quite cold in the nights. 
Huh? For real? Well, let me talk to my buds. Oh, okay. Thought I was gonna have to go back. Oh. Okay, so Yuka's gonna be, that's a relief, thanks old man, but you're sure we don't want to pressure you. Well, I'm a landlord around here, you see. My house is much bigger than my needs. I would appreciate some young folks make use of it. Ah, uh, see Sitaro. I'm really grateful. We'll get the car fixed and leave tomorrow. Very Americanized dubbing. Ah, I can see it now. Ah, uh, Yuda was, whoa, that place is huge. Damn, now that's a mansion. I kind of feel bad, Gramps, but thanks. Rin is the girl. There's a fourth one. I don't... Getting them mixed up. Whoa, it's really roomy inside, too. You gotta be rich, am I right? <laughs> rich enough to be ashamed of the state of this old place, I suppose. Or perhaps. Come along, and I'll show you to your rooms. Well, so far, I've not been doing much, except for... You can use this room, Miss Rin. Forgive the old-fashionedness. It ain't nothing. I kind of like the whole retro thing. Thanks again, Gramps. I'm sure you're all hungry, aren't you? I'll cook you some dinner. Until then, make yourself at home. <laughs> oh, sorry, was that out loud? It wasn't meant to be. Oh, I guess I can walk around now. Do, 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 do. Can I sit in these chairs? There's a bed. A chest of valuables, maybe? There's nothing inside, though. Oh, well. There's the bed. Wait, can I turn this light on? A light stand. Alright, there's chairs. These look like wardrobes. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. Ooh. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. An electric outlet. Huh? I can plug my phone in. Fireplace. A large swamp can be seen in front of the house. Okay. Have a bed. Oh. Go right through the bed. <laughs> Well, there doesn't... Oh, get this thing out of the way. Look like there's anything to do in here. Oh, jeez. Okay. Hey, there's somebody. Uh, Sitaro. Um, what the heck did he sound like? I can't remember. It ain't that old of a building, really. You see the other places out back? Now that's old. Huh? There's another mansion out back? The old man tells me they built this one a generation ago since the other one was falling apart. Huh. Uh, I guess I need to really explore everything, don't I? Just in case there's something important. So that's Sitaro's room. Who's staying here? Oh, this looks like the kitchen. Hmm, I don't have much food in hand for guests. Would chicken and egg on rice be all right? What? I kind of for something beefier, like literally beefier. Unfortunately, I'm out of beef. I must apologize. Oh well, it's anything on this stomach, or maybe on most stomachs. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Not much food, a rice cooker, there's a stove, cookware, oh, here's a trash can. Give me a trash can. Kitchen waste. Dining room. I don't know much going on here. It is a clock. Is there not any other way out of this place? Oh, okay. It's this room. Wait, how did I... That's weird. Washing machine. Huh. Bathtub. Big, big bathtub. Do, 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 do. There's the front door. Where's my friends? Where are you, friends? I bet they're here. Yep. There's somebody. Nice. Your room has a dresser. I ain't got one in mine. Yes, I do. You could. It's a great design, isn't it? You can come over and do your makeup in the morning. Oh, it's a... Okay. Hey, thanks a bunch. It's this thing, not a dresser, that's a um, vanity. Nothing inside, nothing inside. This this game isn't very scary yet. Nine minutes. Let's check our last friend and we'll try to explore the ground floor. Yuda, hey Ren, you see the big swamp in front? Yeah, the one you can see out of the windows? It's super huge, isn't it? Maybe I'll go swimming tomorrow. Yeah, uh, stay away from me after you do that, because you are going to reek. Yeah, if you go into a swamp, you certainly know our drawers are empty. Nothing, nothing. It's probably a waste to look everywhere, but I mean, it is one of those 8-bit games you're supposed to explore. Okay, let's see what other rooms we have in this house. It's this one. Ooh, there's a television here. What is that? What is that? 
I have no idea what that is. Oh, wait. Whoa. Ho, ho, ho. Now that's a mermaid right there. Blech. Yeah, that's an actual mermaid. That's how they used to that's how they used to be described. They were not pleasant. Um they're not Oh, that door is locked. They're not pleasant creatures. Here's a television set. Clock. Wait. There's an old phone. Nice. This will take us back out to the hall. There we go. That's the ground floor. So I think we're going to stop for this episode, everybody. We're going to go back to our room for a moment. And we'll stop here. We'll start here next time. So thanks for watching. As always, I appreciate it. Next time we will look upstairs.